What's going on YouTube? Yama Yachty, welcome to the channel. And in today's episode, guys, we're working on my brand new 2022 Yamaha MT-09 SP. Guys, we are installing some tank pads today for grip and protection, and you know that I only use the best. So we're going with tech spec. Guys, they sent me a set out. We're gonna be installing that today. I love the look, I love the grip, I love the snakeskin feel. And guys, you know they are the best in the market. So thank you tech specs for the tank pads, but we'll be installing that today. So if you want, stick around, stay tuned and enjoy. If any of this content interests you, do me a huge favor. Don't forget to hit the like button. If you want, go ahead and subscribe to the channel and hit the bell notification to be notified of all new uploads. All right, guys, here's the envelope that I got from TechSpec, and I want to say thank you so much to TechSpec for sending these out to me so fast, especially around the holidays. Guys, I just picked up the 2022 Yamaha MT-09, and I did not want to ride it or even try to do anything without the tank pads installed. So I reached out to their tech support, and guys, they were gracious enough to help me out on this episode and send me a set of the TechSpec pads. I had them on the 2021 MT-09, and I tried to take them off thinking I could reuse them. Guys, silly mistake. I thought maybe I could heat it, put a little glue, but nah it's not going to work so do not do that but thank you so much tech spec for hooking me up and here's how they come in the envelope and guys don't worry about the envelope these things are so durable and so stiff and such an amazing product that they are not going to get ruined so when you order it don't freak out about the envelope they come amazingly packed super durable super grippy guys and this is the only pads that i'll use moving forward why because i had so much success on the mt09 with them that honestly guys i will only use these going forward i had some one designs on my r1 they would peel i would have to put double tape things like that when you clean the tank and install these guys it's never coming out all right guys there's my denatured alcohol you can get this at home depot or lowe's or probably even uh ace hardware i go ahead and just pour some onto the chamois right here or this microfiber rag just kind of get it a little little wet and then all i do is just clean out the tank really really well this will not strip the clear or damage the paint on the bike itself so i just go ahead and wipe this down really really good just to get all the oils all the solvents all the lubricants off of the tank before we install those pads it's just going to give it a lot more adhesion it just really helps keep those pads in place so that way they never peel off All right, guys, I'm gonna go ahead and cut this package open. Next thing you wanna do is just kind of align the tank pad, just get a visual of where you think you're gonna install this thing. I had really good luck the last time putting it pretty dang perfect of where I wanted it, which is about right about here. So this is not the first time I've done this, but uh, definitely get a nice little spot of where you think you're gonna stick it. Just kind of have it in your mental note. And what you're gonna have to do is make both sides identical. They say to mark it with a little piece of paper or some type of indicator, but I'm pretty good at eyeballing it. So I'm just gonna kind of go by eye and go from there.
right guys, side one is complete. Let's go ahead and do the center. And then you just repeat the same process on the other side. guys so there it is here is the tank pad like i was telling you guys i kind of put it under the seat because i don't like the fact that it covers the logo so i just put it you know about a half inch under the logo here make sure it's even on both sides come straight down the seat installs no problem like that and it actually kind of keeps it off the tank from kind of scratching on the sides and guys as you can see the sides are completed and I have it on both sides. And guys, they're probably not exactly identical, but they are super, super close. And guys, as you're sitting on the bike, like I am here, as you can see, man, you get a lot of grip here on the sides. And when you're really trying to lean on the bike, as you lift up your leg, it's really gonna catch the grip here on the underside of this tank, as you can see here with my leg. So that's why I love these grips so much because they do the job very well. They look really, really good. And they really go with the profile of the bike. And I love that snakeskin looking textile that comes on it. So here are the text spec tank pads guys again tech spec thank you so much for sending these out to me and guys if you do not have tank pads don't go to aliexpress and buy some cheap ones don't buy the fake yamaha knockoff ones get the tech spec these things are awesome they have a lot of grip they protect the bike they look good and guys it's a pro line and their tech support is very awesome man i reached out to them and boom they took care of me no problem and this thing came in like two or three days guys so the shipping is phenomenal just follow the instructions clean the surface and you should be good to go and with that being said guys be blessed Ride safe, take it easy on them filthy streets. And remember, you gotta work on Monday. Peace.